we scheduled you to talk a little bit about uh, going into the midterms, what the message will be for the Democrats. And when you, we're going to put some of the, uh, the ideas they've come up with lately up on the big board. Uh, Bernie Sanders, who, who loves free stuff for everybody, he would like to guarantee a $15 job for every American. Cory Booker announced the Federal Jobs Guarantee uh, Development Act, which would call for the Department of Labor to select up to 15 areas to institute a job guarantee. And then a fellow by the name of Andrew Yang is suggesting that universal income, everybody gets $1,000 a month regardless of what you do. So here is one of the big reasons I'm running. I, I believe that... Um, I present an opportunity to broaden the back of the elephant, to include millennials and minorities the way no other candidate can. Because what you're talking about with what you just brought up mm -hmm. is mortgaging our children's futures. And when I talk to college Republicans and high schoolers all over the state of Michigan, I say the torch will not be passed. It must be taken. Right now, we have a critical situation right now. We need to move forward. And also for minorities, being able to think freely. We don't want free stuff. We just want a fair shot. And when given the opportunity to think for ourselves and compete, we will win. Well, when you do the thinking, you got to wonder, okay, that sounds great. I'd love $1,000 a month. Right, but Who who's going to pay it? for it? Yeah, of course. Exactly. Who's going to pay for it? They don't answer that question, no, do they? because they can't answer that question. Uh, you have people like Bernie Sanders in Washington legislating a future that they will not be a part of. And I have two little boys, and I have an obligation as their father to protect them. We, are just ha we just have to be good stewards of the amazing country we've been given, because this country doesn't belong to us. It belongs to our future generations. So you've got uh, the Democrats pushing an agenda that is further to the left than uh, what uh, mainstream has seen for a very long time. And then you've got uh, yesterday with the Kanye West back and forth on Twitter, you've got it very clear that some on the political left want to demonize anybody who so supports the president uh, just because they know that, that can, <clears throat> people will be less likely to say, yeah, I, I think what he's doing is a good job because they don't want to be uh, tagged as mentally unbalanced, as many people have suggested that uh, Kanye West is out of his mind. In an era when mental health is such a serious issue, um, by trivializing it like this uh, is, is, is terrible. Um, but the biggest thing is, is a free thinking person is a threat to the democratic marketing machine that poses itself as the only solution for America's gut. When, uh, when you take God out of government, uh, then you make government your God. And that's exactly what the liberal progressive left want. I believe in faith and family, God and country, and service before self, and I'm going to be fighting for our conservative values in Washington. Well, right now you're fighting for a job. You would like to be the new senator from the great state of Michigan? Yes, sir. Sir, thank you very much for joining us live.